Murray and Loretta Smith run their certified grasslands operation on their property Palm Grove in Mowra, Queensland. We don't treat any of our cattle for antibiotics unless we really have to, but then we, we segregate them and put a special management tag in them so that when they go to the meat works they're defined as having had an antibiotic. We don't promote our cattle with our hormonal growth probe, promotants. We also just run them on pasture only. We don't supplement them with any sort of grains at all. We do supplement them with forage crops, but that is crops that are grown in the ground that aren't grain consisting. It's just all pasture fed cattle. Dry weather conditions pose a threat to their cattle herd at times. However, smart management and the use of high protein forages, such as Lab Lab and Lucina, ensures that cattle are always in good health. The, certainly the rain is our biggest, the weather is our biggest uh, obstacle and with the, it's, well in my lifetime I do think that the weather has changed and the sun seems to have more burn in it, maybe I'm just getting older and softer but with the grassland accreditation with teas they must be fed predominantly on grass, they can be fed forage crops as long as they don't have any grain content. If, if you're feeding forage oats to cattle in the winter time. As they come out of their mum, six or eight weeks old, or when we get them at six months old, I should say, they just go onto the grass and we fatten them till the day they go to teas on the grass only. Some years are better than others, but Murray and Loretta hope to pass on the legacy they left on the property to their children one day. You hope to sort of develop a small kingdom and, and pass it on to your to your relatives or your family and and my hope is that it'll stay in the family. I wouldn't like to think I worked all my life and then when I retire they just sell it all up and, and, and uh, don't continue on my legacy. The Smiths will continue their lifestyle on their property and their kids will still play a major role in mustering and working the cattle.